Julie Matthews, thank you for your kind words. Kelly Storm, how do I feel about hypnosis? Ah, hypnosis. Um, I've seen it happen. I believe in it for sure. Um, I think if you've maybe got some stuff in you that you're worried about that's maybe repressed, um, and you've got someone that's uh, a hypnosis, is at least certified or whatever, uh, and there's someone you trust, I'd go for it. Um, me, I, I have trust issues with other people messing with my subconscious. Um, because, again, you start to get into allowing someone to mess with your free will. Now, if it's someone that's truly a good person, kind person, and only interested in doing what they want or, or what you're asking, then great. And if the whole thing's recorded and you can verify that, awesome. But if you say, yes, I give you permission verbally, consciously to another individual to mess with my subconscious self and they choose to do something that's not good, you've given them permission and that will happen. So hypnosis is something that is very powerful and with great power comes great responsibility. And if someone is not good, like I have a really good friend that is not a good friend. Like he's intentionally tried to make me jealous with people I was dating, like just really weird, random stuff. And he was a hypnosis person that was a certified hypnosis. He's like, would you let me hypno hypnotize you? And I'm like, first off, I'm sure you can't. I I've been through hypnosis before and it didn't work. And he's like, I bet you I could. And I said, and secondly, I would never let you hypnotize me and he got a smirk on his face because he would have he would have put some weird thing in my brain like i'd be anytime a doorbell rang i'd be like i'd be like why do i do that it'd be him so be careful that's all